Hey there lads and ladies, it is Petrifying Pumpkins here and I am back with a Flyer Wall Ultra video. This one's very exciting. This one is one I've been wanting to make for quite some time now, but we've had to wait for a few more weeks than maybe we would have liked. However, despite the fears, despite the concerns about the quietness around First Contact Entertainment, they have since broken the silence since last night and they've delivered us news about updates 1.1. .1 two and they've given us some details about it which i will go over right now attention firewall contractors we know everyone has been waiting on a new update for a while now and we're happy to announce a very large patch is coming soon a lot has been going on behind the scenes for the last few weeks as we've continued working diligently on improving firewall ultra and we are excited to unveil what's coming next to patch 1.12 We'll have more specifics available when the patch goes live, but for now we can say there will be two brand new maps free for everyone in all modes. Adjustments to Diaz's lightweight perk and other perks, as well as targeted updates and improvements to the assignment system, including decreasing steps required to complete assignments, increasing payouts for assignments, and decreasing the thresholds for unlocking tier two and tier three assignments at each black road dealer there will be other gameplay and bug fixes as well so this is one of our biggest patches yet thank you to everyone that has stuck it out with us as we continue working on the game and taking your feedback following this update we'll be sharing details about our first seasonal operation coming soon as well so there's a lot going on here this explains why it took so long as well i believe because they're adding new maps so it's not just bugs and fixes so i think maybe sony have to test out the new maps like the sony qa team or whatever so maybe that would explain why they said you know a few weeks ago that this patch was ready to go basically and they're waiting for the go ahead i'm guessing the sony qa team or whatever needed to thoroughly test these maps to make sure that everything was uh, a-okay hence the long waiting time and the fact that they're talking about it now must mean that we're very close to the end of this wait so there's a few key things obviously what's going to jump out to a lot of people is the fact that there's two brand new maps that means they're not returning from firewall zero hour these are going to be two original maps for firewall ultra that we've never seen before personally i'm hoping for a snow map i said that i've been saying that for years in firewall zero hour as well i just want a snow map i think with the power of the psvr2 and the ps5 they could really do justice to uh, some kind of a snow weather setting or even just snow on the ground or whatever i'd like that too it is really interesting as well that Diaz's lightweight perk is going to be adjusted as presumably that means he's going to be nerfed to some degree. Now, whether he's going to be slowed down or whether his stamina is going to take the nerf uh, remains to be seen. We don't know the details and also other perks are going to be adjusted. So keep in mind, they're not saying nerfs. They're not saying buffs either, of course. Uh, but if you're thinking about other perks in the game that might need some adjustments, you probably think about maybe Raha again. Obviously, Raha's perk was heavily nerfed because it was super overpowered as it launched uh, but could they perhaps be doing something with raha again to make her perk more useful we'll have to wait and see and then of course another very welcome change in my opinion the two biggest things that firewall ultra have has needed uh, since the last update has been adjust the grenade system and reduce the grind so it didn't say anything about grenades but this whole assignment thing seems to be heavily, heavily, um, what's the, I don't want to say nerf or buff, that's probably not the correct terms to be using here, but it sounds like they've severely reduced the grind there to, uh, to make tiers and the whole assignment system less of a pain to get through because, listen, I've nearly got 100 hours in the game. I think I'm only on tier two and like one or two of the dealers right now. Uh, so it's just, uh, it's been way too, way too grindy and I'm hoping it is a significant decrease and not just a small kind of a thing and then of course they say there will be other gameplay and bug fixes as well so that could be a toggle grip that could be i mean technically your grenade adjustments could be in that as well although i think they probably would have mentioned as if it was because that's such a desired request so they don't have a date on when this is going to drop it kind of seems like it's going to drop any time now and then once it does drop it sounds like they'll give us some more detailed patch notes which we can go over and obviously when the patch comes out i'll be testing this as well on a stream to see what it looks like and man i can't wait for the maps i really i'm really interested to see what these maps look like uh obviously the only original map we got in firewall ultra was the crossroads map and that is actually probably my favorite map in ultra uh even though it does have them 
it has that crash bug on Ultra. I don't know what it is about that map where it seems to crash more than any other map. Uh, but I'm still looking forward to seeing what they're able to pull off for ground up PS5 maps, if you know what I mean. Anyway, that is it for this firewall news updates. There will be more when more information drops. So stay tuned if you're interested in keeping up to date with Firewall Ultra. Before I end the video though, I have to thank my channel members and they are the following. Muzz, Deadeye Dan, Chopped PPE, No One Knows, Movemaster Mick Esports Commentator for Hire, Deej the Pumpkin Patch Kid, Pete Hawkins, Crumb, Superfly, Edify Till I Die, Lone Wolf Vior, Aced, Germ Warfare, Pass Leading Fox Jr., Durban Brown, Higher Primate 30, Prophecy 777, Amanda Clark, Jason Ewan, Roy Schwartz, Jeremiah, Infinity Lefty, Obi Wan Kenozi, Chinese Letters That I Can't Read, Pepper, Hashtag One Number One, Mini Whale Dropus, Horatio Ward, CS132, Faz, Kiwi D, Noah, Red Rose, Brian Sewell, TB, Nert Boglin, Turbo Turner, Freps Nominal, Harge 101, Monkey Nuts 176, The Virtual Resistance, Kayo, Eziki, Monday Left Me Broken, DJ Sun 57, Michael Stokes, Andrew Albright, Ernie 78WA, Sack, Iron Hal, Shapeshifter, The Amorphous Gamecast, Eden Shaw, Gary Gortzen and Mr. 777. Thank you everyone for your support. If you want to be a member as well, you can hit the join button somewhere below this video and you will get access to exclusive membership perks. That is it for this video, lads and ladies. Thank you very much for watching. It's an exciting time once again in Firewall Ultraland. After three or so weeks of silence, we are back. We're back. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Please stay nice and moist.